Hi, Meg, Matt, Mackenzie, and Maddie. I got it, everybody. <laughs> Hi. Uh, this is uh, Mackenzie's video lesson for today. Um, uh, three things I want to talk about. And um, at the end of the lesson, if you have questions or want me to look at anything or want, to clar want me to clarify anything, uh, just shoot me over a message. I'll be more than happy to uh, do my best to answer. So cool. We'll jump right on into it. Um, so first thing, number one, is are moon walks. Um, she's been getting that moon hop down pretty well, just using the one finger here. What we want to start doing is we start we want to start getting both of these fingers to play alternating back and forth. Um, actually, what, what, um, what Maddie does, basically. So way to start that with Mackenzie is first, to see, can you do big moon hops? So on the moon, there's a lot less gravity. You actually go real far and you move real slow. Excuse me. You move real slow, so we want to do real slow, just like we're on the moon. Walking fingers. So middle finger goes, pointer finger goes. In the beginning, it might be kind of like a little mash of this right here. That's fine. That's how it always starts. And see if you can really make the fingers like they're like walking around on the guitar. We got the surface of the moon, and we can hop around. Can you make big hops? And can you kick in the air when you're when you're when you're running? So you get a running start, you kick in the air, and then land back down. And then you can obviously see where now that's going. So jump, kick the feet in the air, you know, hop around, have a race. Who can go from one side of the room to the other side doing walking fingers? We right? have students do that. Well, someone will start over there and you'll see who can get across the room the quickest. Right? Try that. Number two is rhythm, doing ta's and tt's. So half her play on just an open string, doesn't need anything special. Open string on the, uh, see I'll pick the G string for example. Ta, 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 it's a quarter note, right? Ta, ta, and then if she gets his moon fingers down, ta, T, 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 right? Ta, ta, T, 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 and when we get that moon finger down, T, 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 ta, ta, You do them open strings. You can do you can use that in conjunction with like which one's the B string, which one's the E string, and then you can do can you do ta's on the B string? Can you do TT's on the E string? You can mix things up like that, make a little game. Number three, your tall fingers. Making sure that all these fingers over here are tall and don't let them fall down. Right. Sometimes I use the word collapse, but then I realize the kids don't actually know what that even means. So uh, you have a tall finger, a tall ring ring man, and then don't let them fall down. Right, so we keep the building tall and don't let that building fall down like this, right? All right, can you go from the sleepy hand to tall ring finger? Right, don't let the don't want to fall down. Same thing with the middle finger. <clears throat> Bring that middle finger up, keep him tall, don't let him fall down. Keep him with a tall ring middle finger. Same thing with the pointer finger. Keep him tall. This one's a little kind of an odd duck. You might come in the, like, the side like this a little bit. That's okay. Tall finger here. And then don't let him fall down. Tall finger. You know, maybe what you can do, Matt could um, grab his guitar and see if he has a, t you know, see if Mackenzie can help him get a tall finger and see if she can tell the difference between uh, the tall finger or um, the finger that has fallen down. Cool, so work on those three things. Um, if you want me to take a look at any pieces or songs or anything like that, feel free to record her and send it over here and I'll give my two cents on what to do with it. Um, if not, uh, have a great fourth, have a great time in Wisconsin, and uh, looking forward to seeing you the following week. Take care.